Hey there, everyone. My name is Anthony Avina. Welcome to my daily vlog. It is day 306 for November 2nd, 2014. Welcome. Uh, sorry I haven't vlogged until evening hours. It's getting to be dark soon. Uh, the hour change threw everyone off. But I also haven't vlogged yet today because I've been writing all day. I already surpassed the uh, daily requirement uh, that they recommend that you have. I've written a total of 5,269 words now. Hold on. Mandy. 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 Hey, that's enough. That's, that's enough. That's boo boo. Mandy, that's enough, baby. <sighs> Sorry about that. She is getting older. I know, boo boo. I know you know. Mandy, our puppy. Right there. She is getting older and uh, she has something going on in her mind that's telling her she needs to drink as much as possible and it's literally to the point where you have to pull her away and she's fighting you on it so that's why someone always has to be out here watching her when she goes does her business now anyways like i was saying i'm at to, up to 5269 words i still got more writing to do but for right now i'm going to take a break from writing and i'm going to focus on marketing right now um i looked up how to convert my books into a PDF format because that's what they recommend you do when you're going to submit to reviewers to review your story. I'm going to be doing that. I found a group on Goodreads that does that. Um, I'm also going to be, um, I looked up how to make an electronic press kit. I'm going to be doing that. Um, yeah, lots of stuff going on right now. So uh, that's the plan. I'm trying to make connections, meet friends, and um, promote my books, and a lot of stuff. Just wanted to give everyone the heads up that, uh, the, that's weird, uh, anyways, sorry, um, weekly videos, you know I do daily vlogs every day, but I also try and make weekly videos on certain days, um, you know, my ghost stories on Tuesday, my weekly readings on Wednesdays, all that. For the month of November, since I'm doing this writing thing, those videos might be a little more sporadic than normal. Uh, I'm going to try and film them when I can, uh, but I don't want to put too much pressure on myself because I want to make sure I dedicate a lot of time to this writing. So, so, there might be days where the normal videos won't go up. Like today, I normally would film um, the On Request Magazine Weekly Riff thing that I told you guys about. I did an episode of it so far. Uh, I still might do it later tonight, but so far I just haven't had the time. I got too much stuff on my plate, so we'll see how that goes. But I gotta get back inside. I just want to say hey. I'll see you guys like in a read? Do you like being scared? Do you like things that are free? Then click on the link to get four free books. Hey everyone. So, it's the end of the night. Um, I've been super busy. Um, I've been doing a lot of promotional stuff and. Uh, Joining some groups, making, trying to, you know, make contacts. I'm trying to see if uh, there are any reviewers out there who would want to re review my book. If you guys are writers and who happen to be watching this, um, and you have a blog or a magazine you write for or something, uh, and would like to review my book, just let me know and uh, send me a comment or an email or something, and uh, we can work on that. So, um, but I didn't really do much else besides work today. Um, catching up on YouTube and uh, just getting over the weekend. Um, what should we call it? I'm really feeling the groove right now for uh, my writing. I'm really enjoying it thoroughly and uh, it's doing really, really well. I'm liking how it's coming together, and I think I was telling my family today. The biggest difference between past projects I've worked on and this project is not only having the deadline, uh, it makes me more focused, but doing this uh, book, I already know in my head how it's going to end. 
I know it ahead of time. And I think that helps me uh, because I see the end goal. I see what happens and now I know how the, how many different ways I can flesh out the story to get to that point, to get to that ending. Um, and so I have a lot of background and storylines that I can work with uh, for each character. And that's really, really cool. It's helping me stay focused on the task at hand. So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I am going to be put, I put some new links down below, um, new um, deals with uh, B&H Photo video. Um, there's a whole bunch of deals going on right now on their site for new products, uh, electronics and video camera work and software, stuff like that. Uh, so make sure you check out the link down below. Also, um, <sighs> sorry. I have my Goodreads profile there. Um, I'm a verified author now on Goodreads, which is really cool. Um, that's about it. I put up a new blog today on my personal blog, so make sure you check out my Tumblr down below. Uh, it's about uh, the importance of uh, having dreams, uh, like dreams of where you want to go in your life, not like going to bed's dreams. Um, but yeah, uh, it's been a productive day, and I'm still going to go for a little bit now. Uh, before I go, I just wanted to uh, give my condolences to the family of Brittany Maynard. Uh, Maynard or Maynard. Um, I apologize uh, if that is not how you say your name. Um, but I followed the story. Uh, this young woman uh, was diagnosed with brain cancer, and... Uh, she chose to uh, end the, her life the way she chose to. Um, moved to Oregon, and she's a newlywed, so it was even harder. And um, she finally passed today. Um, she was dealing with some sheet seizures and pain, and uh, she decided to. Uh, it was the right time, and so uh, she went with her family surrounding her. And very sad um, to see that happen. I respect the heck out of her for doing what she felt was best and for being able to make that choice because uh, you know I know what it's like on a, a smaller scale to live with pain every day uh, and uh, I think when you're faced with a decision like that when it's life or death uh, living with that pain um, when there's no cure when there's no outcome where you could actually come up on, on top um, I think uh, being able to choose uh, is a very important thing. I've always been a big proponent of choice, um, and you know that's. I think that's a, a good question. Uh, so I just wanted to give my condolences to this young woman's family. Um, you know, we're all with you in this tough time, and everyone just uh, leave some kind words and thoughts for um, her and her family. You know, wherever you can so that's it guys that's just all I want to talk about today um, in the comments below uh, in the comments below free let's do free for all today uh, leave whatever kind of comment you want down below thanks for watching guys make sure you check out all the social networking links down below make sure you give this video a big thumbs up please like this video comment on it favorite it, and share it Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to uh, leave some condolences for this young woman and her family. Alright? This is Anthony Vina. Signing out. I almost put my finger on my nose. Sorry. <sighs> this is what happens when it's really late at night. So, word to the wise. Peace out, guys. Long days and pleasant nights.